Welcome to Virtualize Everything, where we strive to educate and inform the viewer about virtualization and virtualization technology. Today's video is going to be about how to upgrade Ubuntu 2104 or 2110 to Ubuntu 22 in the terms of an LXC container. So in a comment yesterday, I realized there's some of you that may not know how to upgrade a repository list for your Proxmox server. And you might not know how to get the newest Ubuntu release version that released on the 21st of this month. Figured it would be a good chance to also show you how to upgrade your previous LXC containers that you may have deployed to the newest version. So with that, let's get to the video. So we're gonna open our web interface and I've already configured a container that we can start working with. So we can open our console that because the container is running. And if you haven't already logged in, go ahead and log in. And at this point, you want to run an apt update. I'm going to chain this together with an apt upgrade. And I'd like to run a full upgrade in this scenario and then I'm going to end this with a switch of dash Y for yes. I've already upgraded this container so there's going to be nothing to run. Chances are you're going to have some more stuff to run. Then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to run a command called do release upgrade. Well let's run one other command first. So let's go ahead and just look at the version of this so you can see that it is indeed version 21.10. Now we're going to go ahead and run a command called do release upgrade. Now when we run this command without the switch you can see that it says no new version found. But we can add a switch of dash D. The dash D switch tells Ubuntu to download the latest version. In this case, today the latest version is going to be 2204 because that LTS version has been released. If we don't use it for some reason, it errors out and so that's what we need to do. In the past I've edited files, but this switch works easier. So now we can press enter and the upgrade process will take effect. We're going to press Y here, and this may take some time. When I did this for my demo test, it took about 15 to 20 minutes, so keep that in mind. And yes, we want to go ahead with this upgrade, even though it could take a little bit of time. So we just press Y and enter. And we want to restart services. We're going to select yes and enter. All right, now we're going to go ahead and give the install the permission to remove the nine packages that are no longer needed by pressing Y and then enter. Now we're going to tell it to restart. It's fairly important to restart after doing an upgrade of this level. It helps make sure everything's running appropriately. So we're just going to press Y and enter to continue. Now we can log in. And this time when we run lsb underscore release dash a, we'll see that we are indeed running Ubuntu 22.04 LTS. So with that we now know how to upgrade our old Ubuntu 2104 or 2110 container to Ubuntu 22.04. So let's go ahead and close this container out and we're going to shut it down. Now let's look at how we might want to update the repository list so we can download a new Ubuntu 22.04 image. So if you go over here to local 
in most cases. You'll see the CT templates and if we click download templates here you'll get a list of all these templates. Now mine's most likely going to be updated as I've already tested this and I know it is. So as we scroll down here we'll see Ubuntu 2204 that's available for downloading. But if you don't see it, here's how we can get it. We'll go back to our server and we're going to click shell. Then we're going to enter the command pveam update and hit enter. Now when we go back to that same screen here at local and templates, you will see it show up. Now a nice note, if you don't have all these turnkey templates, the same command will also grant you all of them. So with that, you can just click on the Ubuntu 2204 and hit download, and it'll download the template. So you can set up Ubuntu 2204 containers from scratch now without going through the upgrade process. I hope you found this video useful in gaining access to Ubuntu 2204 and also how to get your old existing deployed containers up to date to the newest version. As always, have a good night.